three, two. Welcome into tomorrow. I'm Dave Graveline. On this week's ITTV updates, we start our brand new feature with our very own Andrea Brasino, who's going to be providing us with a tech term of the week. First up, though, it's time for our look back at this week in tech history. Here's Chris. Thanks. This week in 1929, Warner Brothers debuted the first all-color talking picture. On with the Show debuted at the Winter Garden Theater in New York City and starred Ethel Waters, Joe E. Brown, and Arthur Lake. In 1848, W.G. Young of Baltimore, Maryland patented the ice cream freezer, just in time for those summertime treats. In 1869 this week, Thomas Edison of Boston, Massachusetts received a patent for his electric voting machine. And in 1961 this week, there was a new sound on the air. FM multiplex stereo broadcasting was enjoyed for the first time by listeners to FM radio in Schenectady, New York, Los Angeles, and Chicago. The FCC adopted the standard a year later. That's our look back at This Week in Tech History. Thanks, Chris, and that's especially good to know about FM radios and some of our best affiliates are FM radio stations. This Week in Tech History, as always, brought to you by TigerDirect.com slash Dave. When you need great prices on computers, peripherals, all sorts of consumer electronics, do go by TigerDirect.com slash Dave. When it comes to selecting loudspeakers for your home theater system, it can be quite tedious. There's so much out on the market, and how do you know what's best for your home theater environment? Well, we decided to hopefully make it a little less tedious. It's time for our product spotlight of the week, and we take a peek at the Niles Audio stage front speakers. Rob Almanza joins us. Hey, Rob. Hi, Dave. Tell me about what's all the fuss involving these Niles Audio speakers. Well, Niles, Niles Audio recently began shipping these babies. These are their home theater stage front loudspeakers. And it's a line that consists of 13 high performance in-wall and freestanding loudspeakers. So we can hide them in a wall if we choose to do so, or in my case, I like seeing the speakers, so on a shelf or on a cabinet for that matter. Either way, these will work well. Exactly. What about any particular specs uh, and the model that we chose? Uh, what model did we actually test here? Well, this is part of the Pro Series box model. The exact model number for this loudspeaker is the Pro 1770 LCR. And what do we like uh, particular features on this model? The neat feature about their new stage front speaker is if you notice the tweeter, it's actually angled up. You can move it up or down to your preference and that way disperse sound better. Tell me about the specs then. Everybody's always concerned about specifications. That's right. Well, this baby is, has a 7-inch high power handling interlaced carbon fiber woofer and it also has a dome tweeters that deliver ultra-wide dispersion, so you're going to get great sound in your home theater. And they work either upright or turned on their sides. Beautiful sound. Yes, they're designed to work with horizontal or vertical insulation. Tell me about the connection options we have as well. well you have two options, actually. If you notice back here on this speaker, you can use regular speaker wire and screws, or you can use a banana cable plug and insert it there. How much do these stage front speakers cost, this particular model, and for that matter, the ballpark from the whole series? Well, you're going to expect to spend a lot of money on this because you're getting great quality. It's sort of high end, and Frank Stern, the president of Niles Audio, been a regular guest on our radio show, actually said that he was designing this because there was no loudspeaker out there that he liked. So he said, we're not going to design a cheap loudspeaker. So this is not cheap. You're going to spend about $500 to $1,800 per speaker. Okay, but again, you get what you pay for. And of course, they come with grills, but as I mentioned earlier, I choose not to hide the speaker. You may choose, or that spouse approval factor, to hide the speaker, so you might want to just simply plug the grills on the front, and you're good to go. Yeah, I'm with you on that. I mean, they're very nice and sleek. The black is great. You're going to love it in your home theater. It's the Niles Audio Stage Front Speaker Series, this week's Product Spotlight on Into Tomorrow. Now it's time for our brand new feature on our weekly ITTV update. Here's Andrea Brasino. Thanks, Dave. And the tech term of the week is consumer electronics. And that's what Into Tomorrow is just all about. Consumer electronics is just the electronic equipment that we use every day. And what are some products that can be classified as consumer electronics? Well, that would be your TV, your calculator, um, your computer, and anything that you have laying around. But who promotes the industry? That will be CEA. And what does that stand for? Consumer Electronics Association. And they are in charge of promoting 
and helping out the manufacturer and the consumer. That is the tech term of the week. Thanks, Andrea. Good job. We'll look forward to your tech term of the week every week here on our ITTV update and, of course, on our national radio show. Have you yet to subscribe to our weekly tech newsletter? It's filled with all sorts of information, tips for you, and even some tech news. Be sure and swing by our website at graveline.com or intotomorrow.com and subscribe to our free once a week tech newsletter. No spam and we don't share your email address with anyone. By the way, we'd love it if you participated on the program. Join us at 1-800-899-INTO. It's toll free from anywhere in North America. We want to hear from you and you want to hear your call on the air. Again, 1-800-899-4686. Thanks for tuning into tomorrow. We'll see you next time.